Hey everybody, what's up? It's Jossie Joss again, and I have a really exciting box that came in. I actually came in a few days ago, but I just haven't had a chance to open it. And it is Lulu March 2016 Loot Crate. Yep, yep, it showed up. Um, I believe the theme of this box was Versus, which is pretty much the theme of a good majority of the subscription boxes out there, uh, you know, aside from a few others, but at least I know this one for sure is versus uh, my 1UP box, uh, which I also received, and I will be filming that again shortly. Um, not today, I'm kind of tired, uh, but uh, they're all versus because of the whole, like, we have uh, Batman versus Superman, Dawn of Justice coming out this month, and then you have the whole, you know, Captain America Civil War coming out in a few months, which is, you know, Captain America versus... Uh, Iron Man, Team Cap versus Team Stark, so lots of versus versus stuff, person versus person or whatever. Anywho, um, if you are interested in getting this box, I'll be sure to post a link in the description below. Uh, but yeah, let's get into the March 2016 Loot Crate box. I'm excited about this box. Um, they said there's supposed to be a exclusive... Uh, Batman vs. Superman item in the box, so that's pretty amazing, especially since the movie hasn't come out yet, so that's kind of cool. So, this is what it looks like inside. The box looks kind of weird. It's like a weird jungly thing, <clears throat> and has verses on the top. Uh, but let's go into the, looks like a shirt. Let's go into the shirt. So the shirt is... A, well, for me, it's a lady's shirt. So it's a lady's cat shirt. It's like a peach color, I guess that would be it. Uh, it's a Loot Crate shirt. It's Loot Crate on the tag, so it's not like another brand. And on the front, it looks like a, like a Versus poster. And it's Star Trek, it's, uh, created by June Roddenberry. And it says Mirror, Mirror. And it's, uh, it's, it has, it's almost like a movie poster. Um, but I believe it's, in, it's for this particular episode of the original Star Trek series where they meet alternative versions of themselves. Um, I believe that's the title of the episode. I am not a huge Star Trek fan. I do enjoy it. Uh, my dad's a bigger Star Trek fan than I am, but I believe I, from like you know just random internet searches and um, you know just talking to people, I believe I remember seeing pictures of alternative uh, or alternate, excuse me, uh, characters from the original Star Trek and basically the only reason you can tell them apart is one has a goatee and one doesn't so like this is original Spock and this is the evil Spock or whatever so that's pretty cool because they do uh, it is kind of like a versus it's like one versus one against the other that's pretty nice so let's go into this thingy it is an alien versus predator uh, loot Crate exclusive item here, which is cool. Uh, Alien vs. Predator Titan vinyl figure, um, and I think it's a blind box. Um, it could be one of these two, so I think that's the Alien, and that is the Predator. So, and I guess these are the possible choices you can get on the back. It says, warning coming 2016, AVP uh, Titans. <laughs> Aww, sad. There's Kane, who is the guy that basically gets his, uh, the alien that jumps out of his chest, uh, character, uh, played by the amazing John Hurt. There's a one, there's a, there's a one where he has a face hugger on his face, and then the other one where he, the, the alien has already busted out of his chest, which is kind of disgusting. Uh, but that's hilarious that he has two characters and they're both kind of either about to die or dead. So, um... Should I open it? <sighs> yeah, why not? If anything, if I don't want it, I can always give it away or try to sell it or whatever, but we'll see. Let's see, who did I get? Who did I get in the blind bag? I got... Oh, oh, there's a weapon. <laughs> I got Predator. Look at him. This is actually really cool. And the fact that he comes with a weapon. That's actually really cool. I might actually keep him because he's adorable. 
Um, it reminds me of the dorbs that they that um, Funko makes because they're small and kind of chibi with like a gigantic head. Uh, but that's pretty cool. I mean, he's menacing, but, um, but cute in the same way. I don't know if that's a thing, but comes with a spear or his weapon. So if I put this here, open the thing, trying not to rip anything here, trying not to break anything either. So I just opened it. So he's got these little like Lego type hands, or it's just like a grip. And oh, and he moves! Oh snap! Look, his hands move. Oh, that's a that's really cool. So he's ready to battle out with some aliens. Oh, look at him! Look at him ready to fight things. Look at him being adorable and predator-like. Yay! But that's pretty cool. I like that. It looks like he's gonna stab himself in the face even though I should probably just keep it like this where he's just holding it. Nice. Alright. I, I, I dig that. I think that's cool. Alright. Awesome. Awesome. Okay. Next item. Another Loot Crate exclusive by BioWorld. It's a Daredevil beanie. I think it's reversible. Oh. Oh, Snapple. This is reversible. That's what I just read it. There's a little sticker. So one side is Daredevil, the other side, if I am correct, I think I'm correct, I think in my head I'm correct, is Punisher. Please correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe this is Punisher, especially with the color scheme. So one side Daredevil, one side Punisher, that is awesome, and it's a Loot Crate exclusive item. Uh, beanies are amazing. Beanie. I love hats and like collect you know like um accessories kind of like that and you know I'm all for the useful uh nerdy items and this is really cool and the, the fact that you can, it's reversible it's even more versatile because you can change the color scheme based on what you're wearing or what themed outfit you're wearing if you're wearing like more of a daredevil theme or if you're doing more of a punisher theme so that is amazing that's awesome uh, really, really, mm, hitting myself in the face with the tag, uh, really, really nice, uh, very soft material, and so, I mean, it, it, I live in Southern California, so it is a bit warm right now, so it's kind of, beanies are not necessarily the preferred headwear to be wearing right now, you'd probably want to wear, like, more like a baseball cap or something, but once it gets colder again, I guarantee you, I'll probably wear one of these, this is pretty nice, very, very nice. Kudos to Loot Crate for that one. All right, next. I love these wallets. That's a wallet. I love these wallets. It's one of those um, Mighty Wallets, if you've ever heard of those. They're made of Tyvek paper, and Tyvek paper is the paper that if you've ever received a package or something from like the Express Mail or something like that, that's not like plastic. It's like a paper material. This is, that's what Tyvek, the, the Tyvek paper is made of. Or that's what Tyvek paper is. It's basically, it's waterproof. Um, you can't rip it. You can cut it with like scissors, but if you wanted to like physically like rip it, you couldn't. And so that's what this is. Tyvek Mighty Wallet. See, it says Mighty Wallet. And it's a Batman versus Superman wallet. That's pretty awesome. And what's funny is my wallet, my current wallet, is a, is a Mighty Wallet. And I've had it, I want to say for like four years. It's I've had it for a really long time. It's super faded, but it hasn't ripped on me yet. It hasn't split. It, has, it just expands because it's paper, and paper just kind of naturally just expands itself. And it's kind of like a book cover. It just kind of molds around the item, kind of almost like water. But that's pretty cool. So on one side, it's a Batman's face with the Superman logo. On the back, it's Superman with the Batman logo. And inside, they have the little advertisements for the wallet and some other things. I don't know if they're flyers. Oh, there's coupons. How nice. So they have coupons and stuff for a Mighty Wallet if you want to get other designs. There's even a design your own. I remember my friend, uh, she bought the design your own. It's just basically white. And since it's paper, you can draw on it. And so she made hers into the TARDIS from Doctor Who because they didn't have that yet. 
I'm sure it's it's out now, but this is a few years ago. And then there's like a dare to tear. Oh, what's the? Ch it says take the challenge. I don't know what the challenge is. I'm assuming it's ch attempting to rip the wallet, and then try to rip, record it on the internet and see if anyone if it, you're able to do it. No, I've had friends who like wrestle and or muscular and buff, and they try to rip wallets like this and they can't. So that's pretty cool. But very nice, very nice wallet. Versatile, men and women can use this. Um, and another, again, another useful nerdy item. I appreciate that. Uh, we have the pin. The, as you know, all the loot crates for the 2016, or for the 2016, sorry, for 2016. Um, they started doing pins instead of buttons, and so this is the versus loot pin for March or versus. It looks like it's Alien versus Predator on it. Got the Predator on the left hand side with his mouth, <laughs> and then the Alien on the other side, and then the versus like lightning bolt in the middle. And of course, uh, you can go to the lootcrate.com slash pins website to unlock something cool. Uh, either a game or extra something, I don't know. But that's really cool that they do that. It's just, it's beyond a pin, which is fun. And now there's a comic. Well, bagged and boarded, the number one, ooh, Harley Quinn Loot Crate exclusive comic. Uh, that's pretty awesome, especially if you're into comics and Harley Quinn specifically. Um, Rated T for teen, according to the bottom corner. Um, that's really nice. Uh, and it's, yeah, it, this is really, really good cardboard too. So um, I probably will not be opening this, so I will probably be giving this away or selling it because um, I don't want to open it, especially if, since it is a number one and it's a Loot Crate exclusive. So I will probably find a good home for this guy. That's really, really awesome. And of course, ooh. Loot Crate presents Word Gush, a party game about everything you love. Download for free on mobile. Huh. Guess to impress in this party game mashup of charades and trivia. Pick a category, then place your phone on your forehead while your friends shout out clues. Sounds like a game I already play called Heads Up. But I'm assuming that this is more, I guess, nerd themed. Because. Heads up's kind of random trivia, it like depends on the category, whereas this one it will probably be more towards, yeah, it says multiple categories to choose from, including video games, comics, movies, and more, so I'm assuming it's something similar. And it says Loot Crate subscribers can unlock free exclusive bonus categories in April, so next month. That's really cool. Ooh, and there's, there's multiple modes of play, it says team versus charades and hum a tune. Okay, so it's a little bit more involved, so that's really awesome. Word gush. I'll be sure to check it out, see what it is. But if you are interested, it's free on on the iPhone or Android. So check it out if you want to. I'm, I might be checking this out. That's pretty cool. Um, and then we have the booklet, the versus booklet for Loot Crate this year or this year, this month. Sorry. So let's go into what was in the box. So we know what everyone got and stuff. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Come on. So many papers. Okay. So the loot pin, I guess if you go onto the website, you'll get a code, and then that code unlocks um, a complimentary rental courtesy of. Voodoo, V-U-D-U, -U, and then your choice, you have either Aliens or Predator. So that's what you'll get when you go to the loot pins, or the lootcrate.com slash pins, and uh, you put in the special code or whatever. You, When you go here to the website, which is lootcrate.com, excuse me, sorry, lootcrate.com slash pins, <clears throat> go put in the code, I guess there's a code that they give you, and then you go to this web, go to their website, which is voodoo.com, and then you get a free rental of either of the movies, so that's cool. Um, if you were an international, so like if you're not here in America, um, if you got the code, you would get a digital comic of Alien vs. Predator. So, that's nice. Let's see. 
So everybody got the shirt, the mirror mirror t-shirt. Uh, that's pretty awesome. Let's see. And I guess uh, it was by a special artist, Juan Ortiz. And he had... Oh, that's cool. He has posters of every single episode of the original Star Trek series. Um, so that's pretty cool. So that is an actual episode, Mirror Mirror, um, of the original series. So that is an actual thing that happened. And so on the bottom, it has examples of other episodes that he's done. So that's really, really cool, especially if you're a fan of the original series. So, nice. Um, everyone got the beanie and everyone got the wallet. So those are on display right there. That's pretty nice. I love that beanie, I think, honestly. Probably, of the box, it's probably my favorite thing. Um, you got the figure from Titan, so you could have gotten the uh, Predator like I did, or the Alien. I personally like the Predator. Uh, never been a fan of the Alien. I don't know if it's the multiple mouths or the bursting out of chests thing. I think the Predator seems a little bit more, uh, I don't know, human-ish? Because it's on two legs and the have armor and stuff. I don't know. That's just personal. What do you want? Who do you like between the two? Do you prefer alien or predator? Let me know. We'll discuss. We'll we'll talk about it, you know? <laughs> and then everyone got the exclusive Harley Quinn comic. So that is the 2016 Loot Crate box, the versus box. Um, it's a pretty nice box. I like the selection of items in the box. Um, my favorite item, it's going to be to toss up between the beanie and the wallet. Um, I'm, I'm always going to, I'm going to be preaching this to the, to the masses. I've always been a fan of practical items when they come into these boxes so I can actually use them. Or if I decide to give it as a gift, they can actually use it. It's not just something that sits on a bookshelf and collects dust or something. Um, so that's really amazing. Uh, but yeah, that's good. Uh, if you're interested in the signing up for Loot Crate, I'll be sure to put a link in the description below. Um, if you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe. I'll be unboxing more things for the rest of the month of March, as well as going into the rest of the year. I'm going to try to keep this up as long as I can, um, and hopefully my channel will develop into something. We'll see what happens. But I appreciate you who have already subscribed. Um, there was a viewer that wanted me to give him a shout out. I believe his name is Zombie Basher. Uh, I apologize for not shouting out to you uh, in prior videos. I just completely forgot about it. I'm so sorry. Uh, having a life outside of these internet videos is kind of slightly stressful, but that's why I love making these videos. They're kind of a release of real, you know, relaxation and stuff. So Zombie Basher, if you're watching, thank you for uh, for watching my videos. I hope you subscribed or told your friends about uh, my awesome videos, uh, or terribly awesome, or terrible unboxing videos, whatever you want to call them. Um, but yeah, that is all, and I uh, hope you guys have a wonderful evening. Bye.